the event, how about a hand for Mr. Corey Kendrick on the piano? From the great city of Chicago, and all my favorite tenor players are from Chicago, so she's very near and dear to my heart. Miss Marlene Rosenberg on the double bass violin. And this next young man uh, was a bit of a homecoming. We had a band together for a number of years, and uh, we all learned to play together. I mean, I was the leader, and I pretended that like, I would say things that I knew what I was talking about, but really I was figuring this stuff out for myself, too. So and I think he figured that out, so he doesn't let me give him any crap anymore. <laughs> but we used to play right across the street every Tuesday night, and it was uh, one of the most important um, you know, experiences of my life because we, we got to grow up together and we got to um, really um, push each other musically, personally, and uh, it's, uh, it's great for, to have him home from L New York City by way of Lansing, Michigan. How about a round of applause, homecoming for Mr. Lawrence Leathers and the drums and cymbals. So that first composition was uh, original by um, my mother's favorite composer. His name is Diego Rivera. And, uh, and uh, that one was entitled The Contender, which is the title track from my latest uh, CD. Um, I don't think they're making records anymore, so there are CDs or albums or projects, I guess they're called. They're hardly even making CDs anymore. You got to call them projects electronic projects that live in the cloud or something like that. In uh, any event, we'd like to continue with a, uh, uh, a John Coltrane classic. And this was actually a lot of um, interviews and a lot of people said that this was one of his favorite compositions. So obviously I, I decided to mess with it and um, do my own uh, interpretation of it. We truly hope you enjoy our interpretation of Naima. Thank you. 